What if I told you that in the near future, blindness could be optional? A world where the darkness lifts and sight is restored with a simple chip in your brain. This isn't a story from the future, but hold on to your seats because Elon Musk's Neuralink has almost turned this into reality. In the next few minutes, we're going to blow your mind with the pioneering technology that's about to revolutionize vision. From bionic eyes to brain-computer interfaces, we're diving deep into Neuralink's audacious mission to cure blindness. So, without any further delay, let's plug in and power up this visual revolution. Before we can grasp how Neuralink plans to restore vision, we need to understand how our eyes and brain work together to create sight. Our eyes are essentially biological cameras. When light enters our eyes, it's focused by the lens onto the retina, a layer of tissue at the back of the eye. The retina contains special cells called photoreceptors that convert light into electrical signals. These signals then travel through the optic nerve to the visual cortex in our brain. But here's the fascinating part. Our brain doesn't receive a fully formed image. Instead, it gets a complex series of electrical impulses that it must decode and interpret. This process happens in layers, starting with basic edge detection and progressing to more complex recognition of objects, colors, and movement. The challenge, when vision fails. Most cases of blindness aren't due to problems in the brain's visual cortex. Instead, they're caused by issues with the eye itself or the optic nerve. This presents both a challenge and an opportunity for Neuralink. If the visual processing system in the brain is still intact, could we bypass the damaged parts and feed visual information directly into the brain? Now, before we move forward to Neuralink's approach, if you are interested in learning about how dangerous AI can be and how Emeka has made a few disturbing statements, then please watch the video shown on your screen. Neuralink's approach to restoring vision is both elegant and revolutionary. Leveraging cutting-edge brain-computer interface, BCI technology, to create what can be described as digital sight. This innovative solution aims to bypass damaged visual pathways and directly stimulate the brain's visual cortex, potentially offering hope to millions suffering from blindness or severe visual impairments. The process begins with visual capture a high-resolution digital camera, likely mounted on a pair of glasses or a similar wearable device, continuously records the user's surroundings. This camera acts as a replacement for the biological eye, capturing light and visual information from the environment. Next comes the crucial step of conversion. The captured visual data is processed and transformed into a format that mimics the electrical signals naturally produced by a healthy eye and optic nerve. This conversion is performed by sophisticated algorithms running on a compact, energy-efficient chip, possibly integrated into the wearable device itself. The converted signals are then wirelessly transmitted to the Neuralink implant in the brain. This implant, known as the Link, is a remarkable piece of technology. About the size of a coin, it contains thousands of flexible electrode threads, each thinner than a human hair. These threads are precisely inserted into specific areas of the brain by Neuralink's custom-built surgical robot, ensuring minimal tissue damage. The final step is stimulation. The Link's electrodes deliver carefully calibrated electrical impulses to neurons in the visual cortex. These impulses are designed to mimic the patterns of activity that would normally be produced by visual input from the eyes. As a result, the brain interprets these signals as visual perceptions, creating the sensation of sight. What sets Neuralink's approach apart is the unprecedented scale and precision of their neural interface. Their current devices can interface with up to 1,024 neurons simultaneously with plans to dramatically increase this number in future iterations. This high-resolution interface could potentially provide a more detailed and nuanced visual experience compared to earlier visual prosthetics. Moreover, Neuralink's system is designed to be bidirectional, capable of both reading neural activity and stimulating neurons. 
This two-way communication could allow for real-time adjustment and optimization of the visual signals, potentially improving the quality of the perceived images over time as the system learns and adapts to the user's brain. While still in the early stages of development, Neuralink's approach to restoring vision represents a convergence of neuroscience, computer technology, and precision engineering that could revolutionize the treatment of blindness and visual impairments. Neuralink's approach isn't entirely new. It builds on decades of research into electrical stimulation of the visual cortex. The key to this technology lies in a phenomenon called phosphonies. Phosphonies are the perception of light or patterns when no light is actually entering the eye. You've probably experienced them when rubbing your eyes or after a sudden impact to your head. Scientists discovered that these phosphines could also be induced by electrical stimulation of the visual cortex. In groundbreaking experiments dating back to the 1960s and 70s, researchers found they could create patterns of light in a blind person's perception by stimulating different areas of the visual cortex with electrodes. This laid the foundation for the development of visual prosthetics. While the fundamental concept of brain-computer interfaces for visual restoration isn't entirely novel, Neuralink brings several groundbreaking advantages to the field. Precision. Neuralink's R1 robot represents a significant leap in electrode placement technology. This robotic system can insert flexible electrode threads with unprecedented accuracy and consistency. This precision is crucial for creating a more detailed and coherent visual perception, as it allows for targeted stimulation of specific neural populations within the visual cortex. Density. Current Neuralink devices boast an impressive array of up to 1,000 electrodes, with ambitious plans to scale this to 3,000 or even 16,000 in the near future. This high electrode density is a game changer for visual prosthetics. More electrodes translate directly to higher resolution vision, potentially allowing users to perceive finer details and more complex visual scenes. Processing power. Neuralink's advanced chips are designed to handle complex visual processing tasks in real time. This onboard processing capability is essential for translating raw visual data into meaningful neural stimulation patterns. The system's ability to rapidly process and adapt to incoming visual information could significantly enhance the quality and naturalness of the perceived image. Wireless capability. Unlike many earlier brain-computer interfaces, Neuralink's system operates wirelessly. This eliminates the need for cumbersome external wires, reducing infection risk and improving user comfort and mobility. These technological advancements position Neuralink at the forefront of neural interface development, offering the potential for more effective and user-friendly visual prosthetics. From pixels to perception, what will users see? It's important to set realistic expectations. The first iterations of Neuralink's visual prosthetic won't provide crystal clear full color vision. Instead, users might perceive something akin to a low resolution monochrome display, think early Atari video games. However, this could still be life changing for many blind individuals. Even a basic ability to perceive edges, shapes and large objects could dramatically improve mobility and independence. Neuralink's journey to cure blindness is just beginning. The company is still in the early stages of human trials for its brain-computer interface technology. Developing a safe, effective visual prosthetic will require years of research, testing, and refinement. However, the potential impact is immense. For millions of people worldwide living with blindness or severe visual impairment, Neuralink's technology offers hope for a future where sight can be restored or even enhanced. Neuralink's ambitious goal of curing blindness represents a convergence of neuroscience, computer technology, and bioengineering. While significant challenges remain, the foundation has been laid for a revolutionary approach to restoring and enhancing human vision. As we look to the future, we can imagine a world where blindness is no longer a permanent condition, 
where sight can be restored, enhanced, and even expanded beyond our natural capabilities. What do you think about Neuralink's approach to curing blindness? Are you excited about the possibilities or do you have concerns? Share your thoughts in the comments below and don't forget to subscribe for more exciting updates on cutting-edge technology and its potential to transform our lives.